hello everybody welcome back to my channel in today's video tutorial I'm gonna show you how to make this infinity top made with an Akara fabric on the screen you will see the measurements I used to achieve this top I was going for a 720 degrees flare peplum which uh, you need four separate peplums to achieve the a full circle peplum So go right ahead and lay your fabric flat, fold into two and then fold into a triangle shape just like I'm showing you. So make sure the measurement is as you want it to be, is as long as you want it to be. Now um, I am trying to check and take the measurement for the waist, like the first circle which should be 2.75 from the measurements I just shown you on the screen on the paper so make sure you mark 2.75 on the top create a circle circle -ish form and this is where you're gonna cut So finish this one out of four flares by making it roundish um, at the bottom. This is to ensure that the, set, the peplum, the flare is round in shape. Like I said earlier, you're gonna need four of this. So this is just me showing you how to make the remaining three. You're just going to use the first one as a template to create the remaining three to make it four. Just watch very closely how I am doing this and this should help you create yours. Now, once you're done, you should have four separate flares, which when sewn together, will make up one whole peplum. Now the next step is to pin all the fabrics together and so make sure you pin them together right side facing and sew three sides of the four peplums together. This will then form a whole peplum. Now the next bit is the waistband. Um, go ahead and cut a long strip of fabric measuring 10 inches in length and long enough to go around your waist comfortably. After that, you should go and press, iron press, just like I'm showing you. This is to enable easy sewing when you're ready to attach it to the peplum. Next is to measure out 15 inches in width and 6 meters in length on a fabric and divide into two, one for each part of your boobs. This is the part that will go over your boobs and you, which we, you will use to design your peplum with as you may. Go right ahead and sew this both sides. Now, remember the waistband we prepared earlier by ironing? This is the part where you attach it to the peplum. 
see how easy it is to attach just because we had done that first step of pre-ironing it beforehand just go right ahead and sew this and attach it onto the peplum and um, watch how you know mine looks so that it will guide you on how you do yours So while you're at it, now will also be the best time to hem the peplum as well. So this is the part where we attach those two long fabrics which we cut out earlier um, onto the peplum. For demonstration purposes, I'll refer to these as the bodies. So lay out the peplum on the table and find the center and place both bodices on it. Place, pin and sew both bodices on it just like I'm showing you. Ensure also that right sides of the fabrics are facing each other. While you're pinning the bodices, you can also make some gathers or some ruffles on them just to create some kind of style. So the last part of this will be adding the zipper at the back. On this day when I was sewing this, I didn't have any zipper and due to the lockdown we are on due to coronavirus, I didn't have any. I had to tie it at the back instead, which you can do um, because it's an infinity top. No one will be none the wiser. Nobody will know what you've done at the back. So that's the beauty of this top itself. I hope I've been able to sufficiently demonstrate to you how to sew the infinity top. I love this top so much because you can tell from my voice. The reason being that it is so versatile and you can turn it into several styles depending on the mood you're in. I mean, just take a look at what I've been able to create so far just with one single piece of clothing. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and as always don't forget to like my video share my video to all your friends and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet i appreciate all of you and until i see you in my next video goodbye